always been very critical of myself. And when I was in school, learning how to read, you know, I mentally I beat myself up because I couldn't understand why everybody else could do it. And I was having such a hard time reading and learning how to cursive write. So I still deal with that today that I am very hard on myself. I'm learning how to not compare myself to others. For example, you know, if a model books a job and, you know, immediately I think it's, ah, because I'm, you know, I look this way. You know, when in the case that's not it, you know, maybe they want someone taller. But learning to not compare myself, you know, because I beat up my own self-esteem a lot with that. And it's my girlfriend, 110%. And, you know, she always, always, you know, like, she has to get me. She's like, okay, breathe. Deep breath in, deep breath out. Now tell me what's wrong. And I do. And then when we start talking about it, you know, not just having like a little hissy fit and, you know, freaking out and thinking, you know, it's me against the world, you know, then I realize like, okay, it's not a big deal. It's going to be a million other chances. So I think my self-confidence before she came into my life was very, it's kind of rocky, you know, and now it's more stable. Like, I still have my little mini blow-ups, you know, once in a while because it's industry. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's fashion. And yeah, I would have to say it's her. And of course, you know, my family, you know, I've called my mom on more than one occasion. I said, I quit. I'm done. I don't want to do this anymore. You know what I mean? And then once I talk it out, like, I'm very, I kind of jump the gun sometimes. You know, I really do. I jump the gun. Like, I'm like, if I didn't book it, I'm like, okay, I'm done. I quit. You know, I really jump the gun and I kind of go to the extreme. And then I thank God I have people that kind of, you know, really back Yeah, they're mm -hmm. like, okay, come back here. You're done over there, you know, you've had your time alone, you know, so come back. So I'd have to say, the people in my life, definitely, definitely keep my self-confidence. Otherwise, I'd be a train wreck right now. <laughs>